L is for the way you look at me. O is for the only one I see you. V is very, very extra, extraordinary. E is for me. I don't remember the rest of the words, but the whole purpose of this video is to say Happy Valentine's Day, L-O-V-E. That's what I was trying to communicate to you just now. Love, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. And so in light of that, allow me to just let you know if nobody told you today, you are loved, you are valued, and you are appreciated. So in light of that love, value, and appreciation, I just wanna give you some tips and tools for Valentine's Day and how to kind of navigate through that whole thing. So three things, three tips that I wanna offer you, and this is just because I love you, but during Valentine's Day, of course, it's all about chocolate and candy and indulgence and sweets. And of course, maybe a little bit of red wine, depending on, you know, if you're if you're a wine person or not. Um, I just want to remind you during this particular time, it's really important to remember that sugar is super, 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 super. Um, uh, it's not the greatest thing for us. And so sugar is often going to create bloat and hope make us hold on to water. And so for those of you who are wanting to keep those laugh lines, uh, at bay and wanting to not emerge puffy the day afterwards. You might want to limit your sugar intake. And for those of you who don't want to be dry and dehydrated and have like all this super like congestion stuff going on, keep your wine at a minimum, okay? And so what I'm saying is for every two glasses of wine you have, you want to have four glasses of water. Just really try to hydrate during this particular time because Caffeine, wine, alcohol, it's all going to dehydrate you. And when I say caffeine, I'm not just talking about um, coffee the day after the uh, Valentine's Day when you're trying to recover from drinking too much wine. I'm talking white tea, black tea, green tea, and yes, even chocolate. So remember, chocolate has caffeine in it too, which helps to um, dry out your system a little bit. And of course, we don't really want that. Um, we don't want to re reap the benefits of that. So what I want you to do is just be mindful of that. And then for every glass of wine that you have, of course, have one, two glasses of water. And for every two glasses of wine, because I don't know very many people that'll stop at just one glass of wine, but for every two glasses of wine you have, have four glasses of water. And just remember, just like the plant, you are a living, breathing organism. So don't go gulping it all down, all crazy like and stuff. Just slowly, slowly, slowly sip throughout the day so that you can have the water that your body is going to need so that you can quickly bounce back and recover from the indulgence of Valentine's Day, okay? So that's my story, I'm sticking to it. This is Fatima Lo Williams, founder of Holistic Life Online. And again, you are loved and happy Valentine's Day.